What is up guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred, back again with another trailer reaction review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Wreck-It Ralph 2 official trailer, not the teaser trailer. The teaser was with the thing when he was feeding the bananas, or the pancakes rather, to the bunnies and one of the bunnies exploded. Funny trailer to get us hyped for the official trailer and to get us hyped to the movie, which I am already ticket sold, but in seat, already down to see this movie. So it doesn't really have to do much selling to me. I am interested interested in watching this trailer for one key reason. There was an image that I'm going to have on screen that was going around the internet about last week. I think it was leaked or maybe Disney and, you know, Walt Disney Pictures put it out. And it was Penelope in a room with tons of Disney princesses. Now, I don't know how that's going to exactly take play in this brand new movie. Hopefully it's in this trailer so we can check it out and see. And there also was a rumor of Mario, the guy that plays the Mario voice, did some lines for Wreck-It Ralph 2. So hopefully we do get a let's go from Mario himself inside of this trailer. I think that would be pretty hype too with, you know, Wreck-It Ralph going to the internet and whatnot. Let's jump in. Let's start the trailer. Let's check it out and give it a great because that's what we're here to do. Review the damn trailer. So let me pull this up. Bong. Move the fuck over. And let me hit play. There we go. Oh, wow. Uh, I hope you guys get it. Yeah, I think it should be good. Start churning butter and put on your church shoes, little sister, because we're about to Little sister. That was kind of cute. Called her little sister. What is it you're trying to say? We're going to the internet. What? Oh, shit. We'll find out Kanye getting a check from Disney. Yeah, it's all stuff we've seen in the teaser with them. Oh, Amazon. Is that Twitter? Snapchat? <laughs> you got Google. It's Thanksgiving. The search bar? He said his autofill. Oh, I only found one result. Oh, come on. oh my Disney. Oh, what? Oh, Theodore. That's cool. Star Wars. I see the um, Iron Man. Oh, say word. They got Stormtroopers. Oh, the Disney princesses. You got Jasmine riding on the. Oh, she was about to get boogie. No. Do animals talk to you? No. Who are you pulling? No. Kidnapped or enslaved? No. Strong man showed up. Yes, what is up with that? She is a princess. <laughs> that is hilarious. That was it? Ralph wrecks the internet? Yes, and he is Wreck It Ralph. Uh, yeah, but break the internet, it's like a thing. Right, it's just wreck the internet kind of sounds better, doesn't it? Mm, you're not wrong. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> right, it's a cool, cute little trailer. It was, it was cute. It was cute. No Mario parents, which is kind of surprising with the leak of um, this guy doing uh, the Mario voice. I'm going to have an image of him. Uh, no Mario kind of wanted to see more video game references, but it was, I guess, with this one being focused on the internet, they kind of wanted to hit that nail home, and they did. They showed Snapchat, they showed Twitter, they showed Google, they showed the search bar, they showed all oh my Disney, and I think that's the name of Disney's website. So uh, it kind of hit every nail, had every reason to show everything, which is pretty cool. Nothing to complain about the trailer. The trailer was good. I think because of that image, it kind of like leaking or you know them putting out that image kind of spoiled the fact that these Disney princesses were gonna be in this trailer in particular now mind you we did get noticed that 
um, the Disney princesses, all of them were gonna be adding their voice work to this movie. So that was kind of spoiled before that they were gonna be in the movie. That image alone took a lot out of my excitement of this, of the Disney princesses being in the movie. Theodore is a good show, but the, and the Stormtroopers as well. Look, let me stop it. Let me uh, slow this down too. That's like when we start seeing all the good stuff, right? Let me go to the, um, what is it, the speed, and let's slow that down. Because we start seeing a ton of, like, little Easter eggs, little spoilers. Let me take this off. But we start seeing a ton of stuff in the trailer, which is kind of cool. Again, I am very excited. But in C for trailer, let's give it a grade. And I'm going to have to, it's going to have to be like a, it's a good trailer. So it's going to get a four. But again, it's nothing that's groundbreaking amazing. Oh, I'll let, I would, I would stop it here. Because this is cool. This is cool. Because we get to see some Disney princesses that we like literally never seen like this before. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but we never seen Mulan and um, Pocahontas and Jasmine animated like this. Now, outside of like um, a TV show, if they appeared in like Sophia the First or, or something like that, but I don't think that counts for like a major motion picture, especially with them now. But let me know if I'm wrong. But they all look to the standards of what's this girl's name, Frozen, and that's that's a good sign. That's a good sign. I I want to see this. I want to see the cinematic universe for Disney be shown more also what this this trailer um, tease too I'm gonna show you guys as well is the possibility of maybe getting more cinematic universes and that's cool that we got a little Theodore right here we got Iron Man I didn't even know that was Iron Man <laughs> what that was Iron Man that flew by I thought that was just like a rocket or some shit but that, that is Iron Man. Look, you could clearly make him out. Clear as day. That is crazy. That is cool. That is cool. And then we get, you know, Disney Powerhouse showing off that they have everything. You know, they got the Muppets right here. We got Cars. We got Frozen. We got Star Wars. Let's keep going. We got Marvel. We got Pixar. You know what I'm saying? We see the Star Troopers flying. We see the Death Star. We even got Up up here flying around in the house we got um iron man's like hand i don't know why they should have they should have threw the fucking um infinity gauntlet up there uh what else do i see i think i see dumbo here let me know if you can make out anything else in this you know in this image right here but i like this trend just like um ready player one like this trend of like blending movies blending properties together i think it's pretty cool it's a great way to touch on nostalgia just this image alone you got the stormtroopers right here and then you got kermit the frog in the background though this trailer all right all right all right it's winning me over the more deep deep dive into it the more i like notice some of the stuff in the movie or in this trailer rather it's 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 it's, it's getting me it's getting me it's getting me it's getting me disney you're doing your thing you're doing your thing this is this is a restricted area and then we get the gangsters the princesses all doing their thing and you got jasmine on the, the carpet you got shorty sleeping Who's that sleeping? Um, Sleeping Beauty. And we got a little bit of Ariel. Is that Ariel? Can't really tell. You see both of them frozen shorties talking to Muhana over here. Pocahontas getting her hair done by Cinderella. Snow White talking to the frog. Kind of cool. Kind of cool. Kind of cool scenery. What blew my mind is the... <laughs> look at Mul What's her name? Mulan. Jump kick into the screen. Like, she's like, hi, everybody jumped into action. You got shorty from Brave jump in. And everybody went to attack. <laughs> look at Pocahontas, though. Cinderella. <laughs> Cinderella like about to stab her with the fucking <laughs> with, the, with the shoe. Oh my god, that's lit. That's lit. That's lit. That's lit. I can see even again watching it more and more. Just getting me this. This is kind of cool. Again, this is like we never really seen Pocahontas done CG like this. Not to this quality. Not to this effect. Not standing right next to Shorty from Frozen and looking quite the same. You know what I'm saying? Like Shorty from Tangled as well. And 
Mohana. Like, it's literally dope. It's dope to see these like this. Let me know who this is at the end. I kind of didn't get it. The the end scene, the way they ended it all, kind of looked like a little Missy Elliott vibe. But again, it kind of fell flat for me, the end part. Uh, even though it was funny, the dialogue. But this is something that could show up in a movie and be funny and you don't really remember. And again, in the trailers, I'm not going to remember it tomorrow. <laughs> so let me know what you think and what score you will give the trailer in the comments below. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Friday on Instagram and Twitter. You guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube. And yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of these trailer reaction reviews. The best way to catch them all is with a subscription. So please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next trailer reaction review.